What's up guys, also back here, welcome back to another video. Today we're back here again on ERLC for another video. So today I will be showcasing the brand new update that just came to the game. It is a pretty big update. We have like three new vehicles um, and some new revamped items uh, and whatnot in game. Chinatown is still here, of course, by the way. Um, so you could still visit Chinatown. This is permanent, as I said in my in, in this update video. You can still buy the dragon, which is pretty cool. Um, but yeah, we also have all oh, these advertisements now are working in game. Uh, a few like months ago, wrote, they added like billboards and whatnot to the game. Um, so ads are now working in game. But those are controlled by Roblox, by the way, not the developers. But that's pretty cool that those ads are now in the game. So the signs are glitched. Um, but that came out a few minutes ago, like 20 minutes ago. It just came out um, around 7:30 Eastern time here. So on Discord, we have a brand new fire hose system, um, which is super realistic. Here, there's a photo on the Discord, and basically the hose reels out of the truck in real life. So it's no longer just like a standalone hose that you grab. Super unrealistic. We now have realistic fire hoses. Some new police light customization, new civilian vehicles, a criminal hideout which was leaked uh, on Friday, yesterday, and a new revamped gun store here. So on the dev forum, once again, fire hose overhaul, some new police light customization options, criminal hideout, gun store revamp, and we do have a brand new uh, vehicle which did replace the Lamborghini Aventador. A few months ago, Lamborghini sued Roblox for using their assets, so all Lamborghinis had it removed from like Roblox driving games and whatnot, so did finally replace this. If you owned the Lamborghini before, you now have this new vehicle for free, but you can purchase it on the civilian team. Um, we also do have a brand new uh, Dodge Charger, uh, Dodge Charger, Dodge Challenger wide body, um, which was uh, previously a PRC. Uh, Alright, so yeah, um, the, um, Dodge Challenger Wide Body has been added to the civilian team, um, which is previously a developer to the vehicle, as I said, you can now purchase this on the civilian team. And lastly, we have a brand new SUV for purchase on the civilian team, um, and we also have some improvements here listed down below. There's now a toll booth added at, uh, High Rock Park, um, a couple of things, there are new variations of motor vehicle accidents, I need to look private server as well, if I go to own servers here, join that, um, um, the requirement to receive a bank truck has been lowered from 2 to 1 players, which is definitely very cool, um, and some other bug fixes and improvements, so yeah, very, very cool update, uh, pretty big, so we're gonna go ahead and get right into this here, um, once I join my freaking private server, I'm pretty sure I click join, um, but yeah, so that's that pretty big update, pretty cool update that we have in game now. Um, all right, I'm loading into my private server here. It's gonna take ages, but yeah. All right, here we go. Um, if I go ahead and go to the firefighter team to start off here for the brand new fire hose revamp update. Um, so if I go ahead and grab a fire truck here. Um, fire engine here. I go ahead and spawn this. Um, Alright, so, so yeah, right here, if I go ahead and press, um, so it's very realistic here. We have like a panel on the side here. So if I press F, um, if I get a hundred feet, now I have a hundred feet of, uh, of attack of a fire hose so now I could go ahead and um, my shift lock is glitched oh my god I have to reset my character but yeah this is very cool and now we have this fire hose here um, so I can press E to pick up or F to discard that is very very cool um, so I'll go ahead and press F to discard and it'll just reel back into the truck now if I press G if I get a hundred feet I have like a different, um, you have a supply line connected to an intake, you must connect it. Oh, so I could connect this to a fire hydrant, I believe, to get more water, which is very, very cool. Pretty sure that's how this works. Connect, yeah, so this is to get more water. So if I click, like, oh, oh there's a fire hydrant over here, probably it won't reach though. 
yeah, it won't reach. Um, so yeah, I could get some more water with this if I move the truck. It'll probably say you can't move the truck. Yeah, well, hose is connected. Um, yeah, this is very cool. So if I discard this, very, very cool new system here. Before, all you do did was like grab something, and if I click water pump here, it'll show you my water level 99% because I um, used a little bit. But that's very, very cool, super realistic. That we actually have like a realistic fire system in game now. So if I press G, G, no, not that. Bro. Six, F, G, oh, 50 feet. If I go ahead and. And if I connect this to a fire hydrant, now I'm getting water added to my truck, which is very cool. And if I can just detach this, and then I click um, remove hose. Very, very cool new system there. P pretty realistic. And there's also like a new watch system for like bush truck and whatnot. So yeah, very, very cool. Moving on though. Um, we have some new police-like customization, so if I head over to the police team here. Um... When, um, head over here. Alright, so I could just go ahead and grab any vehicle here. Um, if I click edit, um, team accessories. So yeah, we do have a brand new, um, uh, what is it? Uh, yeah, so we have a brand new, um, Side runners, I believe it said in the thing. Additional lighting. Um, what does it say on the update log? Oh my god. Uh, you can now choose between two side runner lighting variations. Okay. Side I'm kind of blind. Side runner, side runner. Okay, let me put this standard texture. I'm just, okay. There we go. Okay, finally. It's all the way at the bottom, so it's, it's, they added a separate tab now. So we have regular side runners or small side runners, which is only like two lights. So that's very cool. Regular and small side runner, which is new. Um, and we also have some new dash lights. So if I click that, dash light, and then dash light at the top. So now I could have two dash lights. So I believe that's all there is. Um, dash light and the new uh, thing here, yeah. Yeah, a dash light as a primary light. So if I click full, yeah, it'll have now we have some small side runners and some dash lights. Very, very cool customization options there. Um, but yeah. Moving on to the next thing of this update, we have a brand new criminal hideout. So if I go back to the civilian team here, spawn vehicle. Let me go over the new vehicles first. Exotic 2016 Surrey. Oh, this is a McLaren. Okay. So we have the brand uh, brand new McLaren here uh, for 890000 which I believe is the same price as the Lamborghini. But yeah, if you have the Lamborghini, you can now get this for free, kind of overrides the Lamborghini. So this is a McLaren, oh, I forgot the model, but um, pretty cool new car there. We also have a brand new SUV called like a 2020 Land, yep. This is a, should be a, a, like a Cadillac, yeah, this is the like a... Um, uh, freaking Cadillac um, SUV here that we have in game now. So this is, you could you could buy this for a hundred and fifty four thousand dollars. Cadillac Escalade just came to me. Uh, is in game now, and um, we also do have a uh, Dodge Challenger wide body. Um, yeah, this right here, twenty twenty two Bullhorn, whatever. This used to be a uh, tester exclusive, but now you could buy this for $124,000. Um, so yeah, those are the three new civilian cars. <laughs> Pretty cool cars. But we're going to go ahead and head over to the civilian base. The civilian base, the criminal base. That's what I meant. It's technically the same thing, but... Um, criminal base. Um, it's over at High Rock Park, which is in the, in the back of the map here. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and head over now and see what this is. This was leaked yesterday, so it's kind of like the main point of this update, but still a very cool and very big update. All right, so let's see what this says here. It says 
it is at the top of High Rock Park, um, somewhere up there. Alright. So yeah, right over here we have the entrance of High Rock Park. We now have a toll booth here, which is brand new for this update. Um, yeah, you actually have to pay a toll now. Um, so it asks you if you want to pay a toll for three dollars. Um, but you could kind of just go around, <laughs> you know. Um, so yeah, if you, there's no like system, like you know. All right. So yeah, as I said, um, there is no system detecting whether you go around the gate or not. It's only three dollars. But you know, just just go around to save yourself the money. Um, they might add like, a detection system. You can't go around, but for now, you can just around the gate. Um, we have some signs here, so, nature walk, cabins, trails, and I'm falling off the mountain, walking up the gas. Um, I'm gonna go this way, I don't know where the Cumbridge is, there. Um, Alright, so I'm making my way slowly up the mountain here to see where this new criminal base thingy is. up here. What is this? Cabin's trails. Alright, so there's an observ uh, observatory, uh, like a platform there, some cabins here. Where is the kernel base? Off-road trail, cabins. Where is this kernel base? I'm definitely gonna go this way. I know where it leads to. I cannot find a criminal base here. Um, yeah, it's just more cabins up here. Um, let's see if I could find it with free cam. Probably not, because free cam lags if you go like too far from where you're standing. But you know, might work. So like over here. Does it say where it is? It might just be like, um, Colonel Hyder, Colonel Hyder, Colonel the new, new tunnel. You can find the new Hyder near Hyder Rock Park within the mountainous terrain. So it says near Hyder Rock Park. It doesn't mean necessarily in Hyder Rock Park. Like a tunnel. Sir. If, they, if this thing is like, if it's at that tunnel, I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get out of here, see where this is. It says near Hyder Rock Park, near a tunnel, so I might go back to that tunnel. Now I need to get out of here. Please, please, please. Okay, let me, let me just go down with the person. It's definitely not working out. Alright, up here. Oh my god. Why is this so um, Alright, here we go. Attempting to find the kernel base, because I don't know where it is. Update like just came out, so. I'm gonna go ahead and head, make my way down here. Yeah, it is right here on the side. I thought I saw something like. So it's like over here, um, by the uh, other exit, um, you know, right there. So yeah. If I go in here, um, and I could actually go inside of it. So it says like, you know, there's like some like decoration here. It's like moldy, of course. Um. But yeah, so we have like a vault here. It's kind of just like a worn down little like warehouse thingy or whatever inside High Rock Park. Uh, and there is a tunnel system here. 
Wait, does this lead to somewhere? Is this like the leaked tunnel? I, I'm assuming cops can't get in here. If not, that will kind of like defeat the purpose. Alright, if my recording stops one more time, I'm going to lose my mind. But yeah, the tunnel just kind of leads um through this mountain here. It doesn't really lead very far, but you know, pretty cool. And you can just head back into the tunnel and make my way back to the kernel base. I'm just going to do two cards, oh, so I don't have to like, walk and continue down here to showcase the rest of this update finally. There is no toll booth here, by the way, so you can just enter through here if you want. Um, but yeah, let me finish reading the update logs here. Alright, um, so I go ahead and head over, yeah, back here, so criminal hideout, I showcase that. Three new cars, and yeah, the last thing is a gun store revamp. So the gun store has been revamped. I'm just gonna go ahead and reset and head over there. Oh, but yeah, the gun store uh, next to the fire station, all oh, gun store the game has gotten a revamp. So yeah, it hasn't been revamped in a long time or ever. No, it was actually it got like a shooting range two years ago when we got that Lamborghini. Probably over two years ago by now, but we did get that uh, with the shooting range with the Lamborghini. With the Lamborghini around like, over two years ago, probably at this point. Um, yeah, right over here it is in the corner. Wow, this is a massive revamp. Okay, so we have a couple of like entries here, uh, entryways, and it's in a corner here. Um, ammunition and firearm sale, Liberty County guns and ammo. Um, average American store. Um, <laughs> but yeah, um. Joking aside here, we have a brand new gun store here, so we have like magazines, ammo boxes, you know, everything you need to be a true American citizen. Um, some weapon safes, um, and the shooting range of course is still here. Um, we have like some windows here, you could exit through the back, which leads here, and you could also enter, which leads to like a stock room, I guess this would be considered a stock room, or whatever, the, the back. <laughs> and you could of course just buy the same guns that you you were able to before this update so yeah pretty cool uh, interior nice design kind of long overdue for a thing for a revamp of this location yeah very very cool um so yeah that's pretty much it for the update we do have the uh, new motor vehicle accidents and as i said the bank truck has been reduced from two to one um so yeah after being handcuffed for more than 30 seconds you are now automatically arrested just another quick bug fix there but if I go to the menu here, edit server settings, and I go to like, how do I spawn a call? I forgot. Um, major server calls. How do I? I forgot how to spawn a major server call. Edit. And it will. Yeah, how do I? I honestly forgot how to spawn a major server call. I'm so out of it. Oh, I think I have to be on a uh, freaking. Uh, do I have to be on law enforcement? I, I doubt it. I know you don't have to be on law enforcement. I'm pretty sure you can spawn as a civilian. I just don't remember how. I just server settings. Okay, if I go to the uh, um there, it's at the bottom. Um, roadblock pack. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. So if I go to respond, major server calls, edit, go to motor vehicle accident, um, wait, what? Oh, new variations, okay. So yeah, before it was like the same variation of motor vehicle accident, but now we have like new variations here. So if I go ahead and check this out real quick here for the final thing of this update. If I could go ahead and just spawn a car here, uh, doesn't really matter, but... Um, but yeah, final thing of this update, a pretty long video, I don't know how, how long it is because it got cut off like four times, but you know, I just edited it all together, but Jesus, it's so annoying, um, um, yeah, right over here, we can have a fire here, you know, um, looks like kind of just crashed here, um, three people, yeah, pretty cool. Some new variations of that. Very, very cool. Very cool update overall. Pretty big update. Um, so that's pretty much it for this update. So that's gonna have to wrap up today's video of ERLC. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. 
As always, stay safe and rise. It's an awesome watching. It's in the next video. Peace.